and welcome to my Thermomix kitchen. I'm glad you're joining me. So today I wanted to show you how I make a creamy lemon dressing for my daily salad in the Thermomix. So let's get started. All right, so for this recipe, we are going to switch to the scale, because this is not in cook I do. And we need a, about a cup of plant milk, so somewhere between eight and nine ounces. You add a little bit more, it's going to be you know, slightly thinner. If you add a little less, the dressing is going to be a little thicker. So I'm going to shoot for eight ounces here. Then we're going to need a total of four ounces of nuts. So I'm going to tear this here. Today I'm going to use a mixture of cashews. I'm about two ounces of cashews. An ounce each of hemp seeds and sesame seeds. You can mix up, mix up the, uh, the nuts however you wish. Both, all three of these nuts are relatively neutral tasting, so they make a nice creamy dressing without uh, adding too much spark flavor goes. Okay, that's four ounces of nuts. Then we want the juice of a lemon, or a couple of tablespoons of lemon juice. These lemons are from my backyard. We also need two cloves of garlic. And two spoons of a mustard, low sodium, if you can get it. Okay, Dijon mustard. And then finally we need half a cup of vinegar which comes to about four ounces. Part this again and I'm using a white Modena vinegar. So now we put on the lid and go back to the setting and I'm going to set this for two minutes. And we don't need any heat. I'm just it's speech 10. I'm going to try turning up somewhat slowly to give the chunkier things in there a chance to be chopped up before the uh, up. Alrighty, so while the Thermomix was doing its thing, I cleaned up the kitchen. And I can show you that in a second. And here we are. Can you see those brown speckles there from the whole grain mustard? I'm gonna get myself a spoon. It's, yeah, it's delicious, it's creamy, it's smooth, definitely lemony, and I love it on my salad. Thanks for joining me in my Thermomix kitchen as I showed you how easy it is to make a creamy lemon dressing in the Thermomix. All it took was a few minutes, throw all the ingredients in, turn it on, and then you can walk away from it until it's finished and even take that time to clean up your kitchen. So please remember to like and subscribe. Um, it really does help my grow this jam channel. And if you have any questions about the Thermomix or would like a personalized demo of what you can do in your kitchen, then please contact me directly. And before I let you go, I wanted to show you how to use the pre cleaning function in the Thermomix. So what I've done here is I put some water in it. Now I'm gonna add one drop of liquid, dishwashing liquid. Put the lid back in place and then we swipe over into the pre-clean. Explains to you the different options here. And I'm going to use the one for fats or caramels since there's quite a bit of fat in the nuts. And that will take about eight minutes and I'll show you how clean everything is when that time is up. Eight minutes are up. Let's take a look. It looks clean. If it looks clean, I'm going to uh, rinse this out in the sink. Okay, so here is the mixing bowl. I took it to the sink and rinsed it out and gave it a quick wipe with a dishcloth, making sure that all the last stuck on anything loose. Uh, always with the Thermomix after you get it wet, you want to make sure that your pins down here are uh, that your pins down here are dry, because that's what connects you to the base, to the electronics on the inside, and you don't want corrosion to happen there. While the Thermomix was doing its cleaning, I put my salad dressing away. So here's the salad dressing, ready to go for the next few days. Um, makes about six servings. Thermomix is ready to be put away. Or ready for my next project.